I'm, I don't know why pronouncing it Baja. How did you pronounce it? I was, I was ba- a, yeah. Baja Blast. The Baja Blast. It sounds like innuendo when you say it like that. I don't know why. I think because Baja <laughs> is like how you would say blowjob after you've had a stroke. <laughs> it's like pronounced BJ is Baja. Baja. <laughs> My Baja. Ooh. Ooh. Wow, that's dark already. All right. Welcome back to New Kamek. Also, Darby started work on making a drivable car out of a child's Batmobile bed. It the is. The most pressing oh. uh, issue at the moment. Hey, it might. Priorities. It might be handy in a pinch. Don't you guys already have like four cars? But this is going to be yeah. The but best none car. of them are a Batmobile or a bed. True. <laughs> uh, it is currently. I was on- sleeping in one of the cars. What are you talking about? <laughs> this is true. One it of literally is- was a bed. <laughs> <laughs> you can also make out a person wearing a helmet with a large visor exiting a small bar next to the airport and stumbling toward a helipad where he climbs into a parked helicopter do we see any terrible helicopter wreckage Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. (laughs) i try to recognize all of our strengths and work as a team and get the synergy going on i've noticed that you have no social filter would you like to go talk to a stranger and then try to bite them (laughs) seems like the kind of thing that you're best out of best at out of all of us you mean try to feed (laughs) yeah that's uh uh-huh i was trying to say it in a way that he would understand My good man. <laughs> we can just would be you, good men. Yeah. Would you perchance like to masticate on a strange human perchance here at the heliport? By God, finally somebody speaks in an intelligible conversation. Of course, comrade, I'd be glad to fulfill this <laughs> o- obligation bestowed upon me by such a regal esteemed office. And how. Have you guys ever heard of something called the Mile High Club? (laughs) I mean, yeah. That's when a vampire feeds in a helicopter. I don't think that's what it is. All right, man, it's 2.50 an hour. Can you cover that? I'll tell you what. You let me drive, we'll double that. <laughs> well, he's we'll, he's, uh, he's waving he's waving at, at Augustine. We, 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 no! m- money's no object. We got we got you, boss. How about this? We get up in the air and I start telling you how it all works. Uh, you don't have a a, a a license, do you? A helicopter license? No, hell no. I I, I got a professional driver's license, so so I'm I'm not starting from scratch. I'm good at driving. I'm good at driving weird stuff. I think you just let me do it. Just let you me go I, for it. A CDL is basically a helicopter license. <laughs> See, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I think I got this. It, it stands for copter driver's license. I have never felt more <laughs> confident at anything in my entire <laughs> life than that I can fly this helicopter. <laughs> and you felt confident about a whole oh, lot of stuff. No. I always feel this, confident. This pilot is broken. No, why are we doing this? Why do we do anything? Oh! My guy likes to party. Don't you, boss? <laughs> what was it? What, uh, what was his name? Uh, Dave, Dave Cooper. Cooper. Dave. Dave Cooperum. Dave oh, Cooper. I thought, I thought you were going to do a D.B. Cooper situation for a second. Oh, it's the, here's here's the actual thing. Uh, he's, he's Chopper Dave. Coming up at 10, explosions rip through Sea Lab. We'll have all the details, plus... Chopper Dave! Hi-oh! But I didn't want to just call him Chopper Dave, so Copper Dave, and then the Latin <laughs> word for copper is Cooperum, so he's David Cooperum. That's actually... Okay. D.B. Cooper would have been funnier if he was like, actually D.B. Cooper. <laughs> actually Dave, yeah. Not too late to wreck on it, but... <laughs> he is that, too. So he, he seemed to be Mr. Moneybags. He hired me all the time whenever he was having a party he'd ring me up like oh, i'm drunk let's get the helicopter going and uh that was a pretty sweet gig and there's like no one else in town who's that cool and that rich 
So oh, that's where you're wrong, boss. You're you're, you're meeting them right now. I, I I'm cooler than you even know. You got to take me up in the sky to see how fucking cool I can get. Well, yeah, but like, is this going to be the only time that you book me? Rooftop. Well, that depends on how it goes, son. You gonna <laughs> you gonna bring your A game or what? I I also know where Randy's know. helicopter. In in fact, Randy gave that helicopter to me. No this is, shit. This is serendipity, my guy. And why don't you fly this helicopter over to that to helicopter? To that helicopter? Hell And yeah. then we'll switch. Uh, no. We'll each take one of helicopters up, and we can do like a dogfight or something. <laughs> uh, well, I mean, are these equipped with weapons? As, I mean... <laughs> as fun as that would be, uh, if you're looking to learn how to, how to fly a helicopter... Are you listening to me? I'm looking to fly, (laughs) motherfucker. Let's go. In in all seriousness, I can't I can't see you die tonight. I want to teach you how to do it before I can condone you flying, going in blind. Uh, So you know, like when you sky, Darby looks him in the eye and he says consent, and then he is attempting to dominate. (laughs) Oh my god, no! If your helicopter is gassed up and ready to go and you want to fly it, that's none of my business. But I just have to say, sir, you seem rad as hell. And if you die tonight in a helicopter crash, I will be very sad that we don't get to party. So I would rather you ride with me and learn how to fly a helicopter, but it is your call. Can't he just fly on a droid ride? Like, not have Darby fly it, but like the pilot. Just take him on a droid ride. Yeah, Darby's it's like, all right, all right. I, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. On the on the way to my chopper, you can show me the ropes. <laughs> it's it's so like you, a five minute ride. <laughs> that should be more than enough. <laughs> There's only one solution here. Obviously, we're not going to stop Darby. So the only thing we can do is get back to Darby Manor first. And move the helicopter before he can fly it away. Dave hears all of this and he leans out like, "No, I'm good. You guys aren't coming. There's there's room for all of you." Ah, I don't let these squares crash our party, no, Dave. We, 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 we got can, something we good going on here. Uh, <laughs> have fun. Be safe. Uh, we need to go. These dudes are fucking lame. Let's get the hell out of here. I, I, and appreciate again. I look like David Attenborough. Uh, this is just a full <laughs> like old man, lame. a wild seventy-year-old. Yeah, <laughs> sounds like Darby. Looks like David Attenborough. <laughs> uh, okay, so if no one else intervenes, uh, Dave shrugs, closes the door, and you see the the helicopter blades slowly start to to spin up, and uh, Dave. Uh, advises you to, you know, kind of stand back away from the helicopter. And uh, it begins to lift off. And I have a question for Darby. Darby, yeah. did you drive the group to the airport? Oh, yeah, 100%. Second question. Did you give the keys back to anyone as you were getting into the helicopter? No fucking way. <laughs> he wouldn't, and I would have been too concerned about uh, being in a helicopter with that man, so I wouldn't have said anything. <laughs> Zero percent chance. <laughs> yeah, there's no way. There's no way that happened. Uh, so, awesome. <laughs> all of you are presumably waving to Darby uh, as uh, he is <laughs> helicoptered away with wow. the car key. How fast do you think you could hotwire that car, Excavo? Well, I'm just gonna keep the call on. And you then... wouldn't download a car. <laughs> oh, but I would. So, Darby, as soon as they're, like, reasonably up in the air, like, leans over the controls like he's trying to learn, and then goes for the, you know, tries to take take some blood. He's just gonna feed, feed on the guy. Like, I don't know if you're a cop. And like this, this is kind of what a Darby I'd, spits again. <laughs> fuck, fuck. 
Fuck. I ain't no fucking cop. Like, you can light up all you want. You can do it right now if you want to. That's that's fine. No, no cops in here. If, if you're not one, then no cops in this copter. <laughs> um, in fact, I call it just a tur. Because there's no cop in it. So I'm torn between my... On one hand, my desire to incapacitate this guy and steal his helicopter. But on the other hand... I think he's cool, and I having a friend that would helicopter me around on demand seems really useful. Um, I'm going to take a, a willpower check, and I'm going to say I need three successes. It's, that's a high bar, but statistically, it is, I think, likely. One... Two, three, and a one, which makes it two. Uh, yeah. So I'm I'm burning for celerity. Hang on a second. Okay, Google. How high do helicopters fly? The average altitude for a helicopter to fly at ranges around twelve thousand to fifteen thousand feet. Whoo! Wonderful. Okay. You sink your fangs into him, and he, uh, the kiss happens, and uh, he starts to go limp. He, uh, his hand falls off of, I think there's like a steering wheel kind of thing, or a joystick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't look it up ahead of time. You didn't think Darby was going to steal the helicopter? Do you even know your own players? Probably within a minute, he's he's going to wake up. But yeah, you can just tear him out of the pilot seat and hop in in his place. Yeah, that sounds, that sounds good. Okay, so... I know. want him to wake up just confused in the other seat. Like, I just, like, David <laughs> Copperfielded him. And, like, I've been driving this whole time. So I'm going, like, bold, only confidence. Like, just, I have been piloting this the whole time, and I am a good helicopter pilot. That is my, that is what I'm attempting to pull off. All right. So what the fuck would this roll be? I think. <laughs> I have an obscure driving specialty. He's driving. You do. Or but. Like a subterfuge or something? I don't know. That is, I, I think we specify that as being weird stuff with wheels or tank treads or hovercraft things, uh, ground based vehicles. I'm. Afraid Piloting that is cannot its own help you. Thing? Hey, to be fair, that helicopter is about to be a, a ground base. Okay, vehicle, all right. So. Ye of little faith. <laughs> like, I don't have, like, a lockpick kit I'm not on assuming me. that it was locked. Darby, did you lock the car? No. It's not... Oh, oh my God. I break okay. the window with my Tonto anyway. <laughs> no! No, 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 no. <laughs> 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 Yes. <laughs> no! It didn't even cross my mind that we were hot wiring our own car. Just based on how we are, I assumed we were <laughs> abandoning our car and hot wiring no! a different car. You have the option to do no, that. No, it looks pretty easy cars. according to uh, uh, WikiHow. It looks pretty easy, actually. And uh, two bungee cords coiled up, but like attached to the outside so like you could get attached and then like jump off of either side of the helicopter so like me and augustine for instance or 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 maybe me and archibald he could jump and then jump all the way back up like he if if he you know if he landed on the ground he could use his awesome jumping skills to add to the inertia of the bungee cord and jump literally all the way back up into the helicopter uh (laughs) Yeah, yeah. We could drop him down and have him, like, grab people and bring him all the way back up with his mad... All right, that's... Maybe I've gone too far. What are you What are you looking for in the city? I've spent a lot of time flying over the city. Um, I might be able to, to help. Like, what are you looking for? Well, uh, there's all kinds of criminals out and about. Ne'er-do-well evildoers. Okay, like if you're a cop, that's cool. I don't have anything against cops. I think and he the... spits again. I fucking told you, son. <laughs> I take the law into my own hands. Uh, are you uh like a vigilante or? 
I don't know what that means, but probably. I mean, <laughs> it sounds like something I do. So you're you're patrolling for crime in a helicopter. That's your that's what you're going for. I can see real good, so I'm gonna get way up high, higher than <laughs> is probably safe, and then I'm gonna be scouting like an eagle. Like an eagle scout. What are you going to do if you see like someone getting their purse snatched? Darby takes a sideways glance over the bungee cords. He's like, I'll, I'll figure something out. <laughs> <laughs> you see three people picking through a big pile of electronics and loading some stuff uh, into this van. All of these people are mimes. I'm trying to like speak with my hands the same way I would with my word space and <laughs> the same way <laughs> in, in my left hand a tomato uh, taps at my chest hands in the airs uh, to indicate awesome points at bear I like to think he's also kind of do this out loud <laughs> Padding hands in the air <laughs> I tap on my chest. He, he thinks that they can't hear him. Yeah. <laughs> uh, after doing visual, yeah, they're not deaf. See, I wait a little bit, and then I go. Uh, but he, ha- they can but hear Augustine you. does not know this. He just assumes they are deaf and mute. <laughs> so, <laughs> do you have five intelligence? <laughs> Why else would they be mute? Graham, this might be a great time to plug your. Brilliant new um, web-based invention. Mm-hmm. Oh, the Augustine translator. Oh, the I don't think we've had. I don't think we've had an episode since you created. No, it. we've the, not. The bombasticator. Ah, yes. <laughs> yeah, the bombasticator. I will. Uh, I will edit a little thing about the bombasticator into this video. Uh, for the. I think the the minds need it right now. I think they need it. (laughs) For the 100% of anyone who might be watching us and doesn't know what we're talking about, I, in in an earlier session, we had a theory that you could recreate Augustine's speaking patterns by making a thing that takes normal human speech and then replaces every word with whatever the most obscure or longest synonym for that word would be. And then I actually, I put this together and it it's pretty accurate. Devising a recurrence that takes formula human voice communication and, and then replaces every spoken language with some, the just about haze over or longest equivalent word for that speech communication would be. And, and then I actually put this jointly and it's jolly precise. And he starts walking in that direction with you, but he's like keeping his eye on you. Also, he's walking very mimishly, like <laughs> like his natural walk is a very clownish walk. So, I am per- I am both perplexed and impressed by the uh, the caliber of his stride, and I start emulating just to like practice. He, like, uh, I like his style. He switches to walking with like like there's like a like a a rope that he's pulling himself no. along with. Two helicopters uh, very quickly swoop in from overhead. No. The pilot of one of them <laughs> sees what appears to be a van of ne'er-do-wells stealing stuff 